It is known, and it's not a secret, that unfortunately uh, the conflict between Israel and the Palestinians affects sometimes the relations between Israel and the EU. And I'm not in favor, and I think that this linkage between Israel, the EU, and the Israeli-Palestinian conflict is something that we need to avoid. Uh, and I think that this is an opportunity to say that the future borders of Israel and the future Palestinian state would be discussed and agreed in the negotiations room between Israel and the Palestinian, and not as an EU decision, as we saw uh, in the guidelines that the EU published a few uh, weeks ago relating to Israel and the relations between Israel and the EU. And, um, everyone in the international community, but of course also in the region, should avoid steps, unilateral steps, which could create new obstacles for these uh, negotiations. This is uh, absolutely decisive and crucial for us. Okay. Thank you. Please. They asked me to say a few words in Hebrew, so uh, as I trusted you, that's your... Where do we go? This way? Thank you. Good luck. Thank you. Um, this is a crucial time for your country. It's a crucial time for the whole region. And I think it's also a crucial time for the whole world, which means that everyone in the international community, especially in Europe, knows their own responsibility to support these direct talks. Thank you. Please.